We are about to see something good. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Singapore. Weighing in at 213 pounds. Dan T. Chen. Big time match on tap. When the competition level is this high, you can bet it will be memorable. Always walking around with a chip on his shoulder. He's going to use that anger against his opposition. The WWE Universe just exploded. And his opponent from Cincinnati, Ohio, weighing in at 250. Matches like these with ten. This superstar is coming in with a lot of enthusiasm and energy right now. But what's going to happen when the excitement wears off and he comes to realize he's in a fight against someone looking to take his head off? All I can say is we've seen adrenaline take this superstar very far in the past. But he'll be taking on an individual who is turning a lot of heads as of late. He's gained a level of popularity that is steadily growing week by week. And he wants to prove that the hype is legitimate. Looking for the ripcord. Capo kick connects. A springboard. <laughs> Boom! Every ounce of momentum is now against him. Yeah, now he has to devise a way back into this. A oh, torturous knee. He's lost some of his win now. He had it scouted. He's pushing back now. Maybe he's found a new source of aggression to battle back with. Put into the corner now. Saw that one coming. him with the counter. Planet face first. Showing him what a real alpha male looks like. Uh-oh. Barrel Tope, what? Took a massive risk, but it might have paid off. He continues to press forward. Yeah, he's found an effective form of attack. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Arm control applied and a big boot to the guts. Ooh, well planted knee. Ouch. He's in a little bit of trouble now. Yeah, but you can't count anyone out yet. This match could still go either way. Whoa, not quite yet. Targeting the leg, doing what they have. And look at this. Good God, that's devastating. You're going to be taking that dirt nap. Drop kick. Never a doubt, barely a moment's suspense. This one was about as lopsided as they come. Oh yeah, I am pumped for this guy. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the Usos from Houston, Texas. Weighing in at 220 pounds, Zero Belt, 
Just look at the swagger on display. I love it. Swagger. Really, Saxton? You know a number of people in the back just despise this superstar. Well, the WWE Universe clearly disagrees with you, Corey. Oh, and what else is new? He calls himself the standard bearer of this division and plans on proving it in a matter of moments. And here he comes. And his opponent from Blackpool, England, weighing in at 207 pounds, Charlie Day C. Tensions riding high. Plans on getting things settled in the ring. I can't wait. Guys, we have a superstar that is molded to be the next big thing. While he might be molded, he could still use a little refining. If he can harness that potential, we're looking at the next big thing. Sure, a little rough around the edges, Corey, but there's something that comes with time and experience. But he's going to be facing one superstar who's always evolving. He told me earlier that he's looking to showcase some new moves in this match tonight. Dropped with a suplex. For this, it could still take in flight. Diving body splash. Super kick. Exploder suplex. Oh, just manhandling their opponent. A fallaway slam. I'll just leave it at this. Nobody comes into a match hoping to get chucked around like that. Taking their time. Oh, vertical suplex. Look at the power here. Absolutely incredible. Walking around the ring. Rotating vertical suplex. Nicely done. How's that for a counter? Oh, what an elbow high in the chin. Look, just toying with their opponent right now. Having fun at their expense. Just mocking their opponent right now. Total disrespect. Trying to get that mental edge. You can't let yourself get psyched out. Never This match is brutality starting to show on him. They've definitely taken their lumps at this point. Their opponent is not messing around. Oh, man. Kick to the face. Turns it around. Able to give him the slip. Uh-oh. Start counting, Saxton. One, two, three. We could be here four. all day. Power. I think you're right. That one one off. From the middle rope. Oh, what a splash! The power of a deadlift into a military press. Wow. Walking around incredible. the ring. And a slam. Big splash. He steps foot in the ring again. Oh, look at this. Out to the apron. Oh, my goodness. Are you kidding me? Back suplex. Spine crushing. He is having his way in this one now. You have to give credit to the steady fight he's giving.
Not the leg. Look at this. He just tossed the leg. He's certainly lining him up, but he's wasting too much time. This power. Uh oh. Here he goes for the win. Then he closes it out. What is it going to take to put him away? Evading offense. <laughs> Fires back with a crucial elbow. Oh, super kick. Big wind up and a shoot to the throat. He's already spending that winner's purse. Uh-oh. End of days. Is it enough? Is it enough? There's two. And that'll about do it, folks. Here is your winner. Zero. Things are about to get good. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Edinburgh, Scotland. Weighing in at 250 pounds, Joe Henry. Some would say the superstar thinks a little too much of themselves, but the tape doesn't lie. This is a serious contender for any title. They need to loosen up, have a little fun. Heck, maybe even lose a match once in a while. What? <laughs> that is horrible advice. Damon Kemp has arrived. And someone's about to get slammed through the mat. And his opponent from Apple Valley, Minnesota, weighing in at 220 pounds, Damon Kemp. Damon Kemp now looking to take the spotlight for him. You know, before arriving here, Damon Kemp was a highly successful collegiate athlete. He competed in both freestyle and Greco-Roman wrestling. Without a doubt, Cole, he's a world-class athlete. But most importantly, he's figured out how to put his past experience to good use while also embracing professional wrestling. Yeah, Kemp's proven himself to be a real bruiser between the ropes, as well as someone who's as rough and tough as they come. Yeah, but meeting him in the ring's quite... This game's about winning at any and all costs. This competitor knows exactly what they want to do. Perched on the top row, here it is! Superplex! It's going to take a certain kind of willpower to keep going after being taken down like that. And that was obviously not part of Damon's strategy. Corey, what do you think you have to watch out for when taking out a competitor with Damon Kemp's collegiate pedigree? I'd say it's technical skills, Cole. His desire to take this down to the mat. Kemp wants to crush you in the middle of the ring. Don't let him just have his way. Neckbreaker! Kemp now taking the brunt of the attack. He's doing everything possible to not let Kemp have his way, blocking the collegiate star from using his technical skills. And planted them with a the well-executed DDT. That's gonna hurt. Climbing up top, he's got big plans. Oh, look out. Fails to hit the bullseye. Big boot. Oh. 
He's heading to the floor, but he can't take his time. Counters! Jarring European uppercut. Pulled back into the hip toss. Not the prettiest thing you'll ever see, but it sure looks effective from here. Oh, he's expressing pain now. Yeah, not looking good at all. And now gets tossed into the ring. Boom! Down to Odith, and a double axe handle smash. with a purpose. Setting up. Body Buster. Damon is out. That's it. Cover. An emphatic victory. Here is your winner, Joe Henry. It's the bitter taste of defeat for Damon Kemp tonight. Not for a lack of skill or effort, Kemp just couldn't get the edge in this match. Time to train even harder now so he doesn't repeat the same mistakes he made here. Well, she's ready to get in there and put someone's lights out. Well, at least we know Wendy Chu's going to sleep good, no matter the outcome of the match. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making her way to the ring from Chinatown, New York, Wendy Chu! Wendy Chu, always dressed for comfort, but more than ready for a fight. And you definitely don't want to get run over by the Wendy Choo Choo Train. Yes, I do. A real train. Plans on waking up everyone. The lethargic Wendy Chu. Ready to compete here tonight. Come on, Michael. Wendy loves to get her Z's, but she also loves to kick. But just because she's not the most energetic competitor doesn't mean she doesn't know how to get the job done when it's time. Well, it's time now, Byron. Wendy will hopefully look alive from here on out. Yeah, but she's got to face off against one of the most destructive competitors we've ever seen in the women's division. On an absolute warpath since she came to WWE, she is unlike anything we've seen before. Oh, yeah, she is really getting fired up. This could be big. Going up high. Oh, boy, that soaring. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Plucked out of the air. Can't prepare your face for that. Oh, clothesline! This is just establishing dominance, followed by the stomp. So unpredictable is Wendy Chu. How do you counter someone who seems to be making it up as she goes along? Get on her level. Don't let the cutesy PJs fool you. Choose nuts. You need to throw whatever sense of normalcy you had out the window and expect that this is going to be a very unusual match. Once you understand that, you can fight accordingly. Look at that. Agility like that, easier said than done, gentlemen. Oh, she's flying. Oh, right to the face. 
Looking worse for wear in the corner now. And wow, what a super kick. She shoots up the top rope. Dangerous thinking. Watch out. Delivers the elbow. Bam. The kick lands. Oh, this is going to be nasty. Bull Nelson into the slam. Looking for the victory. Two. Forces the shoulder up after two. Getting that shoulder up now is huge. chest. Wendy is taking charge. Yeah, Chu's appearing unstoppable. Oh, what a stop right to the chest. Are you kidding me? If this works, it could change the course of the match. Oh, well, look at the snap there. Followed up with a nice drop kick. Exclamation point drop kick. She's taking a beating here. Not a bad place to be in, but the longer this goes, the more trouble a superstar exposes themselves. First up, high, big miss right there. Watch her set up in the corner. Everything's going against her now. And you know now she must rethink her strategy. Incoming. Chu might take it here. Is it enough? The cover! It's over. All in a nice work. Here is your winner, Wendy Chu! That's a strong win for Wendy Chu here tonight. Is it? Here comes trouble. The following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 433 pounds. A duo that always delivers when it comes to tag team action and the WWE Universe is ready for it. I got a feeling this match is going to be too sweet. You should never do that again, because these two are Japanese legends continuing a legacy in WWE. That's the bell, and the OC is here, set for action. There are really no egos in the OC, guys. They love to fight and then have a good time outside the ring. That's what happens when you spend as much time making money and making towns as these dudes have, Cole. All that matters after that is the company you keep, and the OC knows that all too well. A very tight-knit crew, you have to admire that. This could be a night of tag team action at its finest. Yeah, you can't ask for a much better matchup than the one in front of us, gentlemen. Tornado DDT! Talk about devastation. Super kick! 
Cesaro's aggression seemed to be quelled by that attack. Looking to do it all himself. Just remember to tag your partner in so you can catch your breath and keep up the performance down the stretch. Ooh, man! From the top, diving senton! And his eyes are piercing through the opposition now. Uh-oh! Suicide dive to the outside! Cole does it better. Throwing all caution to the wind and leaping to the outside. In a super kick! He gets tagged in. Up the turnbuckles from the top! Whoa! What a landing! Trying to do as much damage as humanly possible. But at what cost? Down you go! Enzagiri finds its mark. He may not be aware of the count. He's got to get back in. The adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe is on his side. And well-timed maneuver there. Oh, watch the speed. This blitz of strikes. Oh, man, every single one hitting the mark. <laughs> Bang, drop kick. And Zagiri finds its mark. Super kick. Good night. He's running on empty right now. He needs to get himself some room to regroup fast. Gallows isn't looking too good, brothers. I'm not your brother. Don't speak ill of Gallows. He's going to be just fine. And Gallows expected. Ah, and that was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. Spring. Four, 450 finds the mark. Taking a chance one more time and got Gallows cinched in. Samoa driver. That could be Gallows' demise. There he goes, right into the... There's the tag. I don't think this opponent has any idea what's about to hit. The oh, brain buster. And a frog splash. Pulled out a big move. Oh! You have to respect these men for taking it to the next level. This... Sister Abigail! Good night. Can he put this one away? Such a long and hard-fought match. He earned that victory. Here are your winners. Tag team chemistry in full effect with these two superstars. They say when you know, you know. And I know there's no tag team on the roster that can touch these two guys.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making her way to the ring from London, England, Julia. And guys, this looks to be a match with major implications here in WWE. Could change the entire landscape here. She knows she deserves to be atop this division, and a win tonight will go a long way towards that. Let's see what she can do. And with this match officially underway, we should see quite the fight from her in this one. Oh yeah, she's proven that. For better or worse, she's not the type to give up easily. Some call it stubbornness, but she believes it's absolute resilience. She's definitely not the type to give up easily, that's for sure. And she has to face a woman who has been at the top of her game. It's going to be hard for anyone to take on a superstar with the kind of trajectory she's been on lately. And that definitely made solid impact forearm to the jaw. And now she finds herself only playing defense. Yeah, she's being met with a roadblock every time. That offense taking a toll on her. Yeah, but too soon to be worried. Broken up with a fist to the face. She's managing to find some of that needed breathing room. This could be a good chance for her to get some distance. Suplex! Turnbuckle's the only thing keeping her upright. And both athletes showing that they have each other's number. Oh! She's up on that top turnbuckle. She won't be for... You know what, guys? I was afraid it was going to get to this point. Top rope! Superplex! The agonizing impact. That may well be a turning point in this match. A determined sequence of attacks from her here. Yeah, she's proven difficult to grab a hold of. Brain Buster! You gotta wonder how much damage has been inflicted after a Brain Buster like that. Oh, down by the DDT. She's losing some steam now. Yeah, Cole, but at this point in the match, you still haven't lost the edge. There's the pile driver. Every successive move is putting their opponent in a dicey situation. Hoist it up. Whipped over in a snap suplex. And she can't put an end to any of the offense coming at her. Yeah, her defensive instincts are all that's keeping her alive. Oh, look at this. Creativity applied with the wrist clutch lever. Oh, ow! Uh-oh, submission move. Fujiwara on bar. Oh, nowhere to go. Rolls through. Clever escape and a knee. Swinging the elbow to halt the offense. Oh, man. A Northern Lights bomb. Shot to the body. Now has the arm trapped. Pump handle position. Oh. And they call that the better end. Roll the credits. This one's done. And that's all she wrote. Here is your winner, Julia. And she walks away with a big win. She came into this match with one thing on her mind. And would you look at that? It came to...
<laughs> Are you guys ready? The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Anaheim, California. Weighing in at 215 pounds, Frankie Kazarian. The WWE Universe more than ready to see this one start. This is going to be good. All right, I love this guy. And here we have a superstar with a big chip on his shoulder. He has certainly felt overlooked recently. Well, he has a chance to change that perception in this matchup. But he'll be facing someone who has been looking for a challenging fight for quite some time now. Hopefully, he'll get it tonight. Getting him into the corner. Improving a bit slippery for him there. Springboard! Springboard! Clothesline! Oh my gosh! Big forearm! Boom! Chopping down the opposition. He's taking some good hits. No need to panic. He's still swinging. Drop kick to the face! Whoa! Uh -oh. Suicide dive! That is tossing your own body around without a care. Taking no account for their own well-being. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Connecting with the moonsault. Crossbody. Driver. No man does that better. An emphatic victory. Here is your winner, Frankie Kazarian. This kind of win establishes him to the world. An important win for him in this one. This is what it's all about. All the hard... And here they come. The following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one fall and is for the NXT Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challengers at a combined weight of 563 pounds. And their opponents at a combined weight of three.
One of these teams is going to have to work in unison from bell to bell if they want those tag team titles. Classic tag team action set to get underway. Anything we should know, Corey? Tag your partner, trust your partner, pin the other guys. That about cover it? Sounds good to me. Nice cross body. And Zagiri finds its mark. What a boot. He deflects it right back. Fails to connect on the springboard. Placing them right where they want them, into the corner. Great counter, impressive ring IQ on display there. Pump forearm. Ooh, DDT delivered. The challenger's looking shaken. The analytical mindset of Axiom contributed to that precision. Axiom reverses. Drop kick. Great athleticism. Really just laying it in. Oh. And Axiom got turned around there. One response after another. Back and forth we go. Textbook fireman's carry takeover. I think we know what's coming next. Oh, straight to the floor! An absolutely foolhardy decision made there. That could be very costly. Don't know if the risk was worth it. Thrown out of ringside and back to the mat. Gets him in position. This is not going to end well for him, Michael. Spanish fly! Oh! Momentum is pivoted toward Axiom. Axiom. Oh, Axiom ready to go. And he sets up and hits the golden ratio. But champions need to finish the job. Two. Got it. And they stay atop the tag division. Here are your winners. And still, the NXT Tag Team Champions. The team of Axiom and Look who's here! And the moment this match.
Japan. Toxic. Teams are assembled in their corners. What's going to be the key in this one? Well, teamwork makes the dream work. Mark my words, there's no room for selfishness in this environment. Watch your teammates back, and they'll watch yours. Oh. That unraveled on JC. Oh, look at this. Oh, kicks. Capped off with a big one. And any one of those shots could take you out for good. Corey, what is the game plan for the women in the ring? Well, Cole, as with any tag team match, but especially three-on-three, three, teamwork has to be the foundation. They have to trust and rely on the women on their team. If they can't do that, they've already lost this match. Oh, man! Placing them into the corner. So she tags in. Attempts rarely pay off, but they do wear down your opponent. Brutal stomp to the body. And oh, and then the chest as well. Countered it just in time. Sling blade. Carefully measured knee drop. And the referee gets caught in the line of fire. Seated drop kick connects. Ooh, ooh, saw it coming and got an elbow for their trouble. Vicious knee. And Fallon Henley has taken control. And little by little, she's demoralizing her competition. Oof. And here we go now. Elbow drop. Things taking a turn for her now. Fallon looking to push the advantage after that. Spear. And that was a precisely measured attack. Climbing to the top rope. From way up, face buster. She got her down. Is this it? Stop the ref count before two. Getting the shoulder up before two tells me the end is not near. Boom, face first. Now went low with a drop kick to the knee. A precision strike like that had to be calculated. Oh, man. Good grief. Turn your lights out. I think rage took over in that moment. Nothing but blind rage. Big elbow. Stomp to the body. And, and that was an efficient form of offense for that move. Kicks to the face. Oh my goodness. Just strike it at will. Showing absolutely no mercy at all. Unbelievable athleticism. <laughs> Into the arm bar. That was amazing. Left arm trapped. Wiggles free. Nicely done. She sent flying into the corner. Kicks! Adding insult to injury. It's got to be demoralizing when you're the combatant on the wrong side of the double team. Maybe you want to rework the game plan about now. And that was an effective attack, guys. three credit for an amazing victory here tonight it's always great to visit the pay window but a victory like this makes the winner's purse all that much sweeter
following contest is it Multi-superstar team match underway. These matches always bring out the fast-paced action. Always get the WWE Universe on its feet. This one shouldn't be any different. Oh, target acquired and destroyed. A running Hurricane Rana. Beautiful. It takes a certain level of athleticism to pull that off. Wow, incredible Hurricane Rana. Sidekick finds the mark. Ooh, stinging kick. Oh, man. Tags him in. Moonsault! Joe looking unfocused after that blow. Lee causing damage and making it look good. Knowing how big all six of these men's egos can be, they might struggle to stay on the same page in this matchup, which is why the success of either team is most likely going to boil down to deferring to veteran experience. Whoa, just floating through the air. Got the leg. Ooh, a dragon screw. That'll destroy a knee. And that was a purposeful attack on the knee. Looking to topple the opposition. Elbows to the temple. Planted with a face buster. What an incredible moonsault. Oh, this, this may end it right here, right oh. now. Destroyer. He's been placed in the corner now. Ooh, there's the kick. Second row. Followed by the Panama Sunrise. Joe is on Dream Street. Two count. And he stops the count for his partner. And Coffee is really being knocked around here. Coffee now just trying to survive. Oh, man. Tag. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Vicious right forearm. Hooked up. DDT. Oh, my God. Springboard moonsault. Wow. Oh, through moonsault. My God. Standing moonsault. Spectacular athleticism. <laughs> Left by the turnbuckles. Wes Lee, tremendous athleticism, connects with an elbow. And look at this tiger faint kick around the post. Up high. Whoa, a spiral tap. Wes with a Time move. Boom. And Wes is really dialed in right now. Wes continues. Does he get him here? Major, major win. That'll change his career tonight. Here are your winners. That's a big victory for these three here tonight. This win tonight may have been a career defining moment. They're definitely celebrating like it was. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the NXT Women's Northern Championship. This woman is the real deal.
Introducing the challenger from Florida, Jade Don Booker. And her opponent from Punta Vedra Beach, Florida, the NXT Women's Northern Champion, K. Intensity on the face of the champion. Challenger in the corner. Looking more determined than I've ever seen. This right here is a championship that gained a lot of prestige in short order, guys. Yeah, I mean, once a title match is called by yours truly, you know it finally matters in our industry. Well, you're certainly not Mr. Modest today, are you, Corey? Drop kick hits the mark. Boom! Catching a drop kick. Super kick! Shower and arm. A drop arm breaker. Elbow will break that up. She's on unsteady legs in the corner, needs to recover. Inverted Alabama slam. A powerful message just sent to the champion with that move. From the top. Nobody home for that one. Oh, what a close line. Lariat. She's going up. Top rope here. Oh, my God. Good Lord. Taking flight. You want to talk about putting it all on the line. Always an extra risk when you dive ringside. Oh, that hurt right to the kidney. Golly. Sit out. Slam. Going up top. We're going to finish it off. What? Soaring through the sky and crashing onto their opponent. And look at her feeding off the WWE Universe's energy. At this point, this is incredibly ill-advised. You're in the middle of a match. Ouch. A bad place to be for the challenger. This is where endurance becomes so important in the late stages of the match. Ooh, four. Stop! Now back. Why they're the champ. Cover! Two! I don't understand this. Why the. World, do you stop the count there? I've got a feeling she's going to live to regret that. Body slam slipped out. Inverted DDT. Oh, strong impact. Getting set up for. Oh, what are they going to do here? Set up in position. The title's going nowhere. Kiss your dreams. Good night. That's it. The champ stays the champ. Here is your winner. And still, the NXT Women's Northern Champion.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the NXT North American Championship. Hold on tight, everybody. It's time for some big Duke energy. Duke Hudson earned some major success in NXT and wants to expand his horizons. And here comes one of my favorites. Introducing the challenger. We've seen the NXT North American title in the middle of some of the fiercest matches on the black and gold brand. And for good reason, Michael, the North American Championship puts your name on a short list of champions. It also puts a huge target on your back. Uh-oh, look at what are they gonna do? Oh, right to the face! Right to the back of the neck! And again! Enough! Oh, relax, handle. Oof. And with an onslaught of strikes like that, it's clear they have nothing but punishment on their mind. Uh-oh. Look at this. Uh-oh is right. And there's the fallaway slam. The champ creating some distance with that move. Start counting, Saxton. One, two, three. We could what? be here. I think you're right. All night long. And Hudson wasn't shown any mercy there. He had to be prepared to take some damage tonight. Foot was in overdrive there. From the top. All the way to the outside. Just crashing down with high impact. Fought back with a punch to the gut. Strength being shown here. Tossed around like a rag doll. Saw it coming and got out of there. Ooh, that hurt. Boom! The challenger not looking good right now. This is where endurance becomes so important in the late stages of the match. German suplex. But that's not all. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making her way to the ring from California, Stephanie! Ever since I took my spot here at the commentary table, I have won it.
A self-proclaimed prodigy. Well, it's time to... One of the brightest young talents in all of WWE, Roxanne Perez, is set for action here. Roxanne has already accomplished so much in her young career, it's hard to imagine where she'll be in just a few short years. One thing's for sure, I don't think anything or anyone can stand in her way. She's definitely proven she's up for any challenge. I'm sure tonight will be no different. But let's not ignore the fact that the challenger has championship aspirations on her mind and is not going to let the fact that this match is not for the title derail them. In fact, if anything, it's only made her hungrier for it. Yeah, the title might not be changing hands tonight, but if she has her way, she will be proving a point by standing tall over the champ at the end of this one. The fatigue is setting in for her. She can withstand the punishment, though. And it's been a heck of a journey for Perez thus far. What does she have to do in order to keep it going with a victory in this match? Roxanne is new to WWE, but she's by no means a rookie in this business.
She has well-earned instincts that got her to the dance, and she needs to trust them and remember that whatever happens, she's probably been there before. Able to sidestep it. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. Out! And gets tossed back into the mat. She's going up! Top rope here! Look out! Oh! Things not going how she'd like. And this match is not over yet. Things are only going to get harder from here. This could spell danger for Roxanne. Backbreaker. That'll realign your vertebrae. Perez looks out of it. High risk. Elbow drop from the top. Cover. Two count. And that'll about do it, folks. Here is your winner. Here we go, guys. The following contest is a fatal four-way match and is for the NXT Championship. Introducing the challenger from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 200. And 27 pounds, Ethan Page. Remember, guys, the title's on the line here in this one. And I don't remember the last time the champ was in this much jeopardy, Cole. Tonight might just be the night the title changes hands. This guy. Things are about to get good. And introducing the challenger from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 223 pounds, Sean! This is a big-time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael, and judging from the response on social media heading into this match, we're likely to see a new champ crowned here tonight. And here comes one of my favorites. And introducing the challenger from Greensboro, North Carolina, weighing in at 150 pounds, young boy, Jay Von Evans. Here we go, gentlemen. Hugh. Is Trick Willie. Looking at the champion, I guarantee there is no doubt in their mind as to who is leaving this.
It's always a unique circumstance to be in a fatal four-way match with every superstar for themselves, sinking or swimming on their own. And there's so many different ways you can approach these things, depending on how many superstars are in the ring, who's incapacitated, who's nursing an injury. There's a lot to process in a fatal four-way. You're right, Byron. Sometimes you can't go alone in a fatal four-way. You might need to team up with another superstar, depending on the circumstances. Something tells me we're going to see a little bit of all of it in this one. Into the hammerlock. Oh, boy. And they were just sent flying on that one. Just a perfect mix of pure power and bad intentions. Power slam. Eye on the counter. Neckbreaker. You really have to have eyes in the back of your head in a match like this. Isn't that right, Corey? That's the truth, Cole. A fatal four-way is a match of constantly moving pieces where timing is everything. You really have to pick your spots here because you have three other superstars all gunning for the same thing. Targeted the lower body there, and it was highly effective. Suplex brings them down. Ooh, treading all over their opponent. Sharp knee. Saw it coming and answered with a sharp elbow. Boom! Kick to the face. Set up in the corner of the ring. Watch these strikes. So precise. Oh, we're going to see more. Boom! Pair of boots to the face. Jumping neckbreaker. Ouch. 
Edge. Inside cradle applied, shoulders down. And the count's broken, keeping the match alive. Oh, my Look at goodness. This. From the ground up. Some shock in the arena after that kick out. Able to elude it. Bang! Right over the left field bleachers. Popped right in the face. Oh, check out this power. This is ridiculous. Dominance. Power for him. A bad place to be for the challenger. This deep into a fatal forward match. It's a wonder they're not more banged up. But the grueling nature of this match is definitely getting to them now, gentlemen. He steers clear of contact. And he sends him into the corner. Oh, had that well scouted. We have seen these men unleash a lot of devastation. And he stops the count. But now we see Williams. See it way up there. There it is. Outside. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. <laughs> Booty <Bully> boot. <laughs> Dodges out of the way. Here's the sling blade. And a basement drop kick. Back suplex, no! Driven down! Trick off the ropes. Nice neck breaker. A championship level move. Check out this power. Way up high. High cross! We could have a new champion! Coming back in the ring. Surrender attitude. Bodies have been decimated. Fortitude has been tested. And these fans. Here's the pick. O'Connor rolls. Shoulders are down. With that, Trick Williams continues his reign. Here is your winner. And still the end. And it's not often we see a fatal four-way that doesn't completely descend into chaos. With only one fall to a finish, it's normal to see temporary alliances made. But just as quickly, those alliances are thrown aside to secure the win. This is a match where ambition and ruthlessness really come into play. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Striking at will. You can't get caught in a hailstorm like that if you want to win. Belly to belly suplex. You know, I have to ask Corey, how much of an actual strategy is there in a no disqualification match? Honestly, it depends on the superstar's mindset. Some just want to get through it. Others want to inflict as much damage as possible, and some just go with the flow. Know which mindset you have before the match and stick to it. The challenger eating up some damage, and that'll show people what Williams is made of. Go behind the breaker. Ooh and it's reverse pain for that mistake. Oh, what a clothesline. Forcefully delivered. Enough already. Wrenches the arm. Ooh, nasty kick. DDT plants them. Oh, right to the side of the face. Oh, man. Did you hear the impact? Williams gets countered. Tends a whirl, arm drag. 
The champ getting put to the test here. Took him out the knee. All's fair in love and war, gentlemen. I saw nothing but effective offense. Just dead lifting right there. The power into a power slam. That just reverberated throughout the entire building. Talk about making a statement. Piercing the throat. The champion's down. The champion's down. Oh, my God. We're going to have a new champion. Starting to see the tolls of this match add up. Here's a pin for the title. He breaks up the pin. And Corey, the match continues. I love it. Striking with the knee drop. So precise. Bang! Oh, man. A kendo shot to the head. That can't feel good. Just one right after the other can be stopped. And did you hear the impact of that? Head attempt for the championship. His arm showed off the mat before one. What's it going to take to put this match away? Section hooked up. Here it comes. Spinning brain buster. Check out this power. Way up high. High cross. The title's in jeopardy here. I think the paradigm is now a pen for the championship. Broken up. And the match continues. champion. Wow, I thought for sure that was it. What? This is turning into Swanson Street. Yeah, I think Trick's face might have taken the brunt of that one. And the damage is just going to keep on coming if he can't find the defense for this. And it is clear the mission now is to destroy and incapacitate. To the midsection, hooked up. Here it comes. Spinning brain buster. And he's completely gained the advantage here. It's obvious to see how focused he is now. That's a bad landing. No, an inverted atomic drop. Very nice. The champ shoulders are down. And he breaks up the count. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. He's got a kendo stick. A weapon we've seen used to great effect time and time again. He leaves the ring and there's no count outs in this one. champion what a win he's fought like a champion this whole match and now he has the title to prove it